Hello and welcome, and we are playing DayZ, and this is Wookie the Wizard, and is this door not going to open, is what I'm trying to decide. Okay, oh right, fuck, I changed, so let me, I changed my, uh, what do you call it, key binding. Can I open this without, no, nope, I need a screwdriver, so I have food. Sorry, I'm getting off track here. DayZ, if you haven't heard about DayZ, you've probably been homeless for a while, or just been in a really bad slump, because it's been a very big, it just, it's been out there for a very long time, um, in the game, long in gaming, the gaming world. Um, it's in early alpha, it just came out as a standalone, it used to be a mod for Orma 2, which is kind of like an army type game. And, um, yeah, now it's standalone, early alpha, a lot of glitches. Thing about DayZ is if you die in DayZ, you are dead. You have to get, you have to recreate another chest. This is pretty cool. You have to get another character. Like you have to create another character, start over from scratch. And while this is really cool in some uh, instances, it can also be a huge, bitch. especially because the game is an alpha. Um. Glitches, I'm sure, can kill people, and I, I mean, that can be a huge tragedy for experienced players who have a lot of stuff, you know, guns and all that. So, um, while it, I mean, you can't get too overpowered and you'll always have something to do on DayZ because of that feature, that kind of part in the game, it can also be a huge pain in the ass. Until, of course, they've gotten into beta where everything's more stable, more stable, not stable because it's beta, but more stable or just for release. This game actually is, I'm gonna warn you, it's a $30 price tag. Great game, I don't regret buying it at all. It's very buggy. Uh, it might just be me. You know, a lot of people play Daisy on YouTube, might just be me, but for me, it is, it's it's decently buggy in some areas. So you might wanna watch out for that. So, what we're doing right here is we're trying to find food. I've got, if you notice, I've got this agree yeah, I'm finding a bunch of equipment. I, I, food is at a loss. And I'd really also spray paint. Here we go. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna use it on that. There you go. Yeah, do that. Can I do it? No. Yeah, just, I guess. What's going on, sir? Take it. Will you take it? Come on. Get it. Here, spray paint it. I don't know. What's up with this? Take it. Take the spray paint. Okay, How about this? Let's walk away from you and then come back and see if you're ready. No. Okay. Well, black paint. Black spray paint's being a huge bitch. Oh, yes! This is a glorious day. But I can't pick it up. What's going on here? I will not stop until this fire axe is picked up, okay? Okay? Okay, like I will pick it up on everything that I am. Alright, Jesus Christ. Okay, so basically what happened was, and I'm sorry I didn't get it on recording, I actually had to pause it. Um, I wasn't, as you know, I wasn't picking up the axe, which was a bummer for me, so I re-logged. Axe wasn't there anymore, but I did find a met kit, which I've actually never found. So I'm gonna have to figure out, I, I'm sure bandages just, you know, bandage your bleeding and stuff, so my rags are kind of useless. But these three bottom, besides the blood bag kit, I don't really know anything about. So, what I'm gonna have to do, let me get on top of these mountains and see, not mountains, these little mounds. I thought I saw something off. Okay, there. I want to go there because that looks like there's gonna be some stuff there. Like some nice stuff. And again, I'm new-ish to day, I'm, I'm new, I'm new to day Z. So, I'm gonna make a lot of mistakes. This is probably one of them. I actually, yeah, I was I was running from some, this beast mode zombie. I don't know if anybody says that anymore, but that would be an accurate term to describe that motherfucker because he was launching at me like a missile strike, and it was just awful. And so I, I was actually running for like the past five minutes trying to bob and weave these track star zombies. 
Because you really, you really, um, don't want to fight zombies head-on when you don't have any kind of weapon. Even like a machete, because it takes a while to kill them, and they'll hit you, and they will hit you hard. So you definitely want to have something on you, and you don't want to go looking for trouble. It's all about survival, it's not about killing in this game, to me. I mean, if you've got guns on guns on guns, and ammo on ammo on ammo, then go out and have a fucking spree if you want. But for me, right now, with the stuff that I have, um, not really all about killing. I'm really, really hoping, as I've said numerous times, that there's some kind of just any. Give me a baseball bat. I don't care. Give me a rocket launcher. To be honest with you, that'd be fantastic. I just need one rocket. I just want. I don't even know if there are rocket launchers in this game, but if there are, base gods send one to me. What is this? Is this something? Is this a machete? This is a machete. There we go. Okay. Put that there. I can't pick it up, can I? No, I need more items. Okay, I'm gonna have to... Shit, okay. Just the flashlight. There we go. Okay, I think I'm about to have company, too. So... I'm hoping this isn't the only... Weapon I find because machetes aren't actually that good. Contrary to what they should be, I actually chose a machete over a fireman axe one time, and that was a huge mistake because fireman axes like really kill people. Ah oh, shit! No, this. Bitch. Totaling your ass. That's not blood from her body. It's menstrual blood, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the real world. Can okay, put this away. Pray to God I find a fireman. Valley 